guys, welcome back to my channel. If this is your first time of seeing my beautiful face, you're absolutely welcome. My name is Faisha Yo. Ade, you can call me Faisha Yo or Ade. <laughs> I know I just, I speak so fast, I'll try to cool down. But anyways guys, today's video, I'll be talking about bringing your spouse here with you for studies. So I'll be answering the question because I'm getting a lot of it in my DMs. My comment section, so people are like throwing questions here and there. So I'm like, okay, let me just film a video to answer it. And anyways, guys, I film about coming to study here in Germany and I film about my lifestyle here in Germany, but I can't film about my lifestyle anymore because of the pandemic. We're on a total lockdown to February 14th. We hope it doesn't low expense. My mind, I'm putting my mind to March basically because this lockdown here. We started, they said December 20 something, they moved it. They said January something, they moved it. They said January 31st, they moved it. Now February 14th. So I'm just like, they can't move it again to March. And then by March, I'm just putting my mind that March, last, last, this lockdown must be over. Beg, let everything open back. Even though we don't have to wear masks and restrictions, we are okay, we will restrict, we will compile, we will, we will live by the law. Just please let everybody be opened. Online shopping is not really my thing because I really like to see. I also do some little online shopping, but not really. I really like to see what at times there are some things that I want to buy, like my shoes. I'm, sometimes I wear this size, but like so. Uh, I'm just, I'm diverse. Not what this video is about. Okay, I'm just here to rant. <laughs> okay, guys, now let's dive right into the video. Okay, guys, so now I've been asked this question like a couple of times so i want to answer now the question is can i bring my spouse and my kids with me while coming to study here in germany now this question is yes yes immediately and yes later now let me explain don't drop me well let me explain very well <laughs> now when i say yes immediately this in the sense that you apply for a school year your spouse applies for a school also here in germany both of you open blocked accounts and you come boom life is easy both of you are here right but then later on your kids can come your kids can come with you immediately i'm not sure about that but later on you can bring your kids i'm sure about later on like probably like a year or six months after you can bring your kids over here once you're ready to be settled you go to the rat house for documents that you could take and all of that so yes that is one thing to do but bear in mind your kids you also have to open blocked accounts for them because they don't want you to bring your kids here and then depend on the government. Mm -mm. They really have a lot of expenses on their own that they pay every month to people here living in Germany. So they don't want you to come and add to that. No. So you will also have to open a blocked account. I think it depends on the age, maybe. But sometimes I hear 6,000, 3,000 something. Sometimes I hear 5,000 something. So I think I, I didn't really make a query about it because I don't have any kids I'm bringing. I don't have any husband I'm bringing. So i don't i didn't make any inquiry about it that that much i didn't have to go to the house to go and make inquiry my house is even close by the way to, before I, before i filmed this video so it's closed so i couldn't make any inquiry so that's it there's no there's nobody that i want to go and meet and say hey sister please i want to ask you one thing one thing two things three things you know consign them but then yes you can bring your child your kid later on because the truth is they don't want even you to be far from your kids okay so you can bring after like a while once you and your spouse that is if both of you come here to study at the same time once you and your spouse are here you're settled then you because obviously at the uh, when you're filling your form for your resident permit they'll definitely ask you do you have kids um how would a day what um what's their name their birth certificate and all of that so just bear in mind bring that with you when you're coming a public photocopy or something and then so when you're ready to bring them also bear in mind that you have to open blocked accounts i'm sure about that blocked account but i'm not sure of the amount you have to open but you have to open blocked account for your kids while they're coming here so if you have five kids you open each for the five if you have one you open just one blocked account now i answer that question in that aspect now when i say yes later i mean if you're the only one, probably you're a man or you're a woman, I don't know, coming here to study and then your spouse will be left in Nigeria. You can bring your spouse later when you're settled. Now, when you're settled, you open a block account for yourself, which is 10,000 something now. You bring your spouse later, but not immediately. When you're settled here, you go to the rat house. 
to ask for a family reunion document and all of that probably like a letter to send back to the consulate so your spouse takes it with you with her or with him to the consulate when going with the kids and also your spouse opens a block account a full one a, the ten thousand euros something also then your kids open the amount that you required for the children i really don't know about that it's probably three thousand i said earlier three thousand or five thousand i don't know because some people say three thousand i think three thousand was when the blocked account was about nine thousand something maybe three thousand i don't really know maybe i think it really depends on the age of the child you know if your child is a certain age they might not need so much things when your child is growing they might need more things you know so i really don't know about that because i i've i've not really tried to sponsor anybody yet so i don't know so yes that is it so yes you can bring your spouse later because they don't want you to be away from your family they know that family is everything they understand that they they know that they understand when i say they understand i mean they really understand that so it's fine it's okay you can bring them later but you have to open a blocked account for your spouse and also a blocked account for your child or your children i don't know how many kids you have so yes you can bring them now if you ask me my honest opinion okay about this what is the right thing to pick i would say you should choose that your spouse should also um, register for a school or apply for a school here in germany and also get an, an admission while both of you running together now this is only if you can afford to open the account for the two of you at the same time if not it's better you go for the option of letter of letting your spouse come later but if you can because i feel like that way it's giving both of you um it's not making you guys put your eggs in one basket if you understand what i mean and um yes that's okay but it also depends you know if you have kids and you don't trust dropping your kids for anyone even if it's your parents you're like no i can't leave my kids with my parents i want them with my wife or i want them with their with their with my husband with their dad so this really depends on you. it's a personal thing but if you if for instance you're just married you guys don't have kids yet you both can relocate here and life is going to be very easy i know a couple that both relocated here they both applied for schools in two different cities um one the wife applied to a school in berlin the husband here in cologne the husband is one as my friend and they are both here now they have a child now so they both came with blocked accounts and all of that so that one it really depends on you if you can if you guys can afford probably the parents can sponsor and help and all of that that way you guys go together but if not, it's better for one person to go earlier and then the other person comes to join. This really depends on your pocket. I'm not going to be here to be choosing for you the right options to take. But for my own part, my own advice, I think honestly, my advice is it depends. For instance, a girl like me, I don't mind coming together with a blocked account. You know, if we come together, there's no high expectation. We don't know anybody here. For a while, it's going to be like low, okay? Um before things start going very good that is the honest truth i'm not going to lie to you it's not like when it comes to germany everything is all good and rosy it's not it's 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 a it's well i don't even know also like you have to also because the truth is there's no foreign country i think i was telling my friend the other day i don't even know to my friend i was telling but I was my friend the other day that the truth is that the fact that our parents didn't give birth to us here okay we came here with our two legs <laughs> we came here with our two legs to also and like start a new life things will not be like bed of roses imagine i was like imagine we are back home in africa we're not we're not going to be like going through so much many things that we're going through here because what our parents already laid the foundation for us now that you you are here if you are going to another country probably like canada or america or whatever you have kind of set the standards for your kids you understand what i'm saying you bring them in and then they they also have the privilege to like just continue from where you stopped that is how it is that is what happens when our parents give it to us we have to continue from where they stopped you understand so it's different you came here with your two legs you don't know anybody yet other than god <laughs> and then you start making friends who will later become like families to you yeah and that is it so there's no bed of roses i won't lie to you so if you know that only one person wants to come here and first of all suffer everything and for the man wants to come up first i'm like okay no i'll go through all of this by myself i don't want my wife to go through this or my kids to go through this with me no mostly wife to go through this with me um then yes it's cool you can let your wife stay back but if it's like yes we want to come out also this together we can do this together we believe that two heads are better than none 
than one i said that no than one why not you guys can do it together also okay you guys have to work out a plan when you're here and you guys have, must work towards your plan basically nothing is too big to achieve so i think that is it because i've answered the question that is how you can bring your spouse here and yes you can bring your spouse here you can bring your family here nobody wants you to be away from your family they don't even like that so yes that is it i've answered the question i hope you guys enjoyed this video and if you've watched up until this point and subscribed what are you waiting for um i'm trying to eat 500 subscribers i'm slacking i know because i won't lie about school my school has been on the day for the longest but the truth is my life has been iggy yaga <laughs> my younger still stay my life has been iggy yaga that's been like this <laughs> so busy so but i'm trying my best to like today now i want to film as many videos as i can, as I can film it's late in the evening i'm very tired but i will see what i can do and film so many videos this so i cannot just putting them out like that back to back back to back back to back all right guys no problem if you've watched up to this point and not subscribed what are you waiting for are we fighting should i beg you what do you want you want pizza you want ice cream what do you want <laughs> i'm just joking okay guys please do want to subscribe and join the family and also like this video and leave your comments in the comment section i'm sorry guys this camera just went boom like blurry <laughs> the lens i don't know what happened and just came back myself okay leave your comments in the comment section if you have any question or any video you want me to film you're not clear about definitely ask me i will do well to film them and i'll see you guys in my next video bye